welcome back to Drag Me Back to Hull. Now, since we last met against Crystal Palace, oh, it's been an interesting time. And I say that because it's, it's confusing me. 0-0 with Burnley to start off. Nothing happened. Fantastic. A 5-0 loss to Stoke. Now, this came out of left field and the right-hand side of the field as well. All the sides of the field. There was five goals everywhere. Then we turned it around. 3-0 win against Middlesbrough. They had 10 men. It was bloody marvellous. Um, and then 2-0 against Swansea. What do you know? We beat in Swansea. Um, accents. Probably shouldn't. No, never mind. Watford, 1-0 loss. Tom Cleverley. Apparently he can play football. Who knew? I think it's unrealistic. What else is unrealistic? Turn that around with a 1-0 win against Manchester United. Did we deserve it? Absolutely not. We had one shot on target. There it is. It's the goal. But they didn't take their chances, so fuck them. Ooh, then we carried on that form with a 2-1 win against Arsenal. Where we had 10 men for the last 10 minutes. Did we deserve it? Yeah, actually, we did deserve this. We had like five clear-cut chances. We should have sc scored more, really. It was, we deserved it. And, and no doubt in my mind. We did, uh, yeah, I was, uh, I was about to come in there. But I had, yes. And then previously, I mean, like I did it a minute ago. Played West Ham. 3-1. Nice. Win. Yes. Do you know what that means? Do you know where that leaves us? Well, my friends, I'll tell you. That leaves us needing anything but a loss from our last game secures Europa League football. Now, I... Just think about that. Think about that. Think about the first time I did this with Hull and we didn't get to 20 points. Think about that. Now, think about what's happening in front of your eyes. We win today. We go above 60 points. Just think. Because, please, because I can't do it. I can't think about it. It's absolutely mental. We've, we've, whoa, we've got a minus 10 goal difference. It's the worst until you get to 11th place. How are we here? What are we doing? Why are Sunderland the ones chasing us? Why did Tottenham win the league? Why did Sunderland in the last match beat Tottenham? What is this? This is absolutely bananas. Nevertheless, um, this is what we've been playing for the past few games. You'll notice there's not a huge amount of change. It's still Jakubovic, Robertson, Rano... Ran I've heard it pronounced Ranocchia, actually, or Ranocchia. But that sounds a bit like a pasta. Not because he's Italian. Shut up. Robertson, Ranocchia. I'm going to keep saying it like that. I just feel it's better. Davies. He doesn't give fancy now. Hilbert at right back. Probably his last game for the club. He's on loan. Oh, a lot of these players are on loan. Um, Klukas on the left-hand side. And Die. Mm, will we try and get him back in the next season? You bet your bottom dollar. I'll... Oh, he owes me. I paid a lot out for yellow cards for that man. Evandro starts. Grosicki, who has been in outstanding form in the past few games. Look at this. 7.34 in the past five games. Oh, Up front... Um, it's not Will Keane. He's been dropped to the bench. He's just not good enough. It's Umbukani who's come in. He's got another two goals since that last episode. He's up to three. Look at him. He's nearly up with. He's nearly caught up with Sam Klukas. What a lad. What a lad. But yes, he's been absolutely sensational in the target man role, creating chances willy nilly for Griffiths, who has changed to his complete forward. And I think we found the ideal partnership in a complete forward and target man. It seems to work really well. As you'll know, Griffiths is now up to 14 goals. So one more goal. And my prediction of he's a 15 goal a season man doesn't look so stupid now. Mm -hmm. That's just won't show off until he does it. Shall we go and see? It's the final day of the season. We're playing Everton. It's a bonanza. Play some sound effects here. Yes. Did you like them? More happening. Whoop. Let's play the game. Now in the final day of the season, we're favourites to win the win the game. So. Best, best team ever. Lukaku's got 16 goals. It's only two more in three more games. Piece of shit compared to Le Griffiths. I'm joking, I'd love to have Roman Lukaku on my team, but right now, oh, he's nothing, is he? Nothing. Look at him. 14th, nothing. I've told them all to pick up where they left off last time round. You know, winning, scoring, all the good stuff. 
in all in all, I think, honestly, Leigh Griffiths has been a fantastic signing for 14 goals and six assists. There's actually nothing to be sniffed at. So, it, sarcasm is not necessary. We'll, let's go win, draw, anything like that. Oh, it's a beautiful sight. We, we're we not at home, but it's a nice stadium, isn't it? Let's just skip this. First highlight of the game. Sees Krasicki getting tackled immediately. And Dai and Evandro playing it round like we've seen all season. The recycler and the Brazilian wonder. Oh, Jesus, Griffiths. Um, I've seen a lot of that in the past few games as well. Griffiths, when he doesn't really know what to do, he'll hit one from 30 yards. He doesn't care. Here's Coleman with a throw in. Let's hope it doesn't. Yes, Robertson. He knows what he's doing. He's got it in the bag. And that bag is a bag for life. Oh, no. He's gonna get me. He's gonna. He's gonna get. Oh, Lukaku's nearly scored. I was making jokes about that other man's name. I'm, I'm terribly sorry, Garner. I'm gonna stop it, honestly. Baines whips it in. It's not come to anything. And it hopefully won't. I'm gonna get in there. Get a bit of assertive. Go, get creative, you flags. And as I say all this, the ball's lumped forwards. Griffiths will chase. Won't chase well enough, though, will he? Will he, won't he? Apparently we'll be outnumbered in midfield by Everton. I'm not surprised because they only have two players forward of that. I say that. They're very forward right now. Oh, here they are. We're on the attack. There's still a six of them back there. How do they do this? I think they're sneaking players onto the pitch personally. Umbakani out to Grisicki. Like I say, in the past five games, has been wonderful form. Don't fuck it up right now, though. He's fucked it up right now. Uh, Barkley to Lukaku. Lukaku. He's looking for some options. There's Garner. He's, he's going to pass it. Honestly, I can't stop. I can't stop. It's 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 sad. It's really sad. Ball in. Lukaku's there. Worried about him. Hate him. Don't hate him. Really like him as a player. But hate it when I play against him. Because I know he's just going to cause the defence nightmares all day. And in fact, we haven't really been in this game as of yet. Um, one shot. It was on target, but it was from 30 yards. Mind you, their two shots have been long shots as well. So... Swings, roundabouts, seesaw. No, Coleman's not a seesaw. He's over there. McCarthy comes along. Commentary at its finest. Schneidel into Barkley. He's going to play that ball to Lukaku. And that should have been a goal. Right. So, we're going to just press slightly higher. Close down more. Use the offside trap. Look for the overlap. We're going to completely change it. Shorter passing. Did they see that coming? I don't think so. It's it's not worked yet, has it? Schneidlin to Barkley. Lukaku. Lukaku's through again. It looks like this might be a full game with barely any cuts because I'm just carrying on speaking in between the highlights. Sam Klukas has made a lot of mistakes. He could do one. Right, we just can't get the ball. I've told them to do short passing. He's still trying to lump it forward. I don't know. I don't know. I do know. He's just he's just decided he doesn't really fancy it on the final day of the season. Come on, this is the Europa League, possibly. Yes, Sunderland are winning. We've got to do something here. Not that. That's not what we've got to do. That's the worst thing that we could do. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh dear, oh, 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 it's a great ball, I mean, he's out jumped us there, yeah, it's not the best is it, um, somehow we are still in those places, I don't know if Sunderland Leighton's main is going to score that, yeah, that's gone in off Jakubovic's face, hasn't it, well then, we've got some work to do at half time, as much as it appears we might actually be all right. I can't t tell who's Sunderland anymore. Sunderland, nil nil still. Okay, if Sunderland get a goal against, is that bloody? Oh, it's relegated Burnley. Ugh. If Sunderland get a goal against relegated Burnley, the Europa League dream is over. Sh show me something else. You've been awful, all of you, really have. Let's not piss about anymore. We're going all or nothing. Mixed passing. Look for the overlap. Let's be more expressive. Close down more. Get there. Let's try something. For God's sake, it's annoying that you're not doing anything. All these games, beating Man United, Arsenal, 
everybody. We come to the final game of the season when I put the camera on. You're all turned to shit. <sighs> well, all we've got to do is better Sunderland's result. And if that means not, well, say better. If we lose and they draw, we still get it. But it doesn't feel earned, does it? Griffiths, do something. Not that. Not that. Ah. Oh. Hope Garner gets a, another yellow card. Because then he's going to get sent off. I'm sorry. I'm honestly very sorry. Evandro whips it in. Coleman whips it out. And Die whips it in. Lukaku whips it out. Oh, Garner's off. He's going to go with it. He's going to go all the way up the end with. Okay, Robertson's tackled him. Garner's tackled him right back. And Die's recycling things. And Vandro's passed, dot, not the ball. And Lukaku's on it again. He worries me. Barkley's there. How can this bloody useless sword the formation they're playing do so good? I don't understand football sometimes, most of the time. Now, you've watched the series, you know I understand it at least once or twice a season. Garner on the ball again. I'm not going to make a joke about it this time. Oh, I really wish I didn't do it, but it's just too funny for me. Lukaku's nearly scored again. What are we doing? Why aren't we playing anymore? Why have we just stopped? Why have we stopped? What has happened? What is this it's madness? The corner's not gone well. Well, it has gone well because it's not gone in. But we haven't broken with any sort of conviction. Lucas, do something. Oh, I'll not give away another corner. I can't bear to watch it. Oh, we're gonna have to. We're gonna pump the ball into the box. Hit early crosses. Low. Um, try that. Yes, Ranashia. Ranashia. Grosicki. Just don't. Don't give it away. Come on, the Red Hot Chili Peppers aren't your favourite band. Into Griffiths. Get a goal. 15 for the seat. No. 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 Good save. Good save. 55 minutes gone. I'm going to get aggressive. Tell them to show some passion. And they're going to respond by being entirely lacklustre in defence. Well, yep. That's ooh, fantastic. That's what we get for pushing higher up. We're going to keep doing it, though, because we need some goals. Are we still... Yeah, Sunderland, still... Come on, Burnley! We love you, Burnley. If it's quite all right, we love you, Burnley. You can do the fight, you Burnley. You're already relegated, so... Oh, we love you, Burnley. And if it's quite all right, we love you, Burnley. We're just... We're just, just... The annoying thing is, we've had this in our hands... And what have we done? We've given it, we've given all of our hope and rested it on Burnley. I don't know if you've ever had a feeling like that, unless you're a Burnley fan, uh, in which case I'm very sorry for you, um, for everything you have to go through, everything you have to experience as a football fan. If you, yeah, I'm joking, I like, Burnley aren't bad, Burnley aren't too bad. Um, so this will be a full game, I've decided now, because I've just not stopped talking, that's fine. That's absolutely fine with you, I'm sure. Umbakani, can he get a fourth for the season? Maybe a fifth after that. No, Griffiths, can he get a fifteenth? No, he can give it to Klukas. Klukas, can you get a fifth? Can you? No, what the bloody hell is that? Bloody hell is that? Come on, Klukas. Show me something else. Show me something else. We need a change, maybe. 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 Yes. Change. What shall we do? Decisions. Sam Klukas has been a pile of shit. It's true. It's true. It's damn true. Grisicki swaps with Klukas. Klukas swaps with El Mohamedi. And Grisicki goes to a winger on the left-hand side. Why not? Why not? Because it's a terrible idea? Ha ha ha! You don't know a thing about terrible ideas. Yes. Yes. Henriksen's on as well. Give him a little team talk. Faith in you. He... Feels I lack credibility. I've got 7th place for Hull. Or 8th maybe. And you are being sold El Mohamedi. Because I feel you lack credibility as a player. Yes. How do you like them apples? Tastes a little sour I bet. They're going to score again here. They didn't. I jinxed them. We're never going to score again. If I jinx myself into scoring. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know if that will work. Right, Griffiths. Griffiths. So just so you know, I don't know if you've actually noticed, I play my games on extended highlights. Why? I don't know. 
sometimes I just like seeing how the tactic works and against various things. I feel sometimes with key highlights, you lose a lot of like the in-depthness that will help you decide what's going right and what's going wrong. Of course, sometimes it doesn't matter what you do. You could just sat, be sat here losing 2-0 to Everton on the final day of the season and you just have no idea what to do at this point. Yeah, I don't know if that's ever happened to you. Probably. I mean, what is this? That's a great ball. If it goes anywhere, it hasn't gone anywhere. I mean, what are we doing? Did I say pump the ball to the box? I did, actually, didn't I? I did say that. Um, so, that's not gone well. What we're going to do is not say that anymore. If we could just maybe actually play, though. If we could get the ball back. Go forward a little bit. Go on. Go on. Go on, you cheeky buggers. Go on, you cheeky buggers. They're not doing it. Coleman. Andre Sim Simos. Has put Lukaku. Oh, he really should be scoring more than this. I'm disappointed in myself. He's not even on my team. We love you, Burnley. And if it's quite all right, we love you, Burnley. You shagged my wife. I wouldn't. Burnley, you disgusting people. Um, if you were wanting to do that, um, for making that song up, I know you didn't make that song, but you're disgusting for wanting to do that. I don't have a wife. I have a girlfriend. It's personal information. You shouldn't be asking that, Burnley. Honestly, really, I've forgotten what I'm speaking about. And Bacani has launched one forward to Griffiths. Can we find a way back into this game? Yes, Griffiths has! 15 for the season! Nailed it! Prediction! And as he scores another one now, in which case, I will be happy. Will be very happy. Yes. Um, let's have a look at that. Umbakani with his long target man balls into Griffiths. This has been happening for the past three or four games. This is how he beat Arsenal, because Griffiths was just hanging on Perma as like a shoulder. And Perma as like a turns like a tree. Um, in fact, now we've got that, we're going to aggressively encourage them for the final four minutes. Um, since nothing's happening, we're actually going to go overload. Just to you know, throw it all away. Or self-assurance. Unless we score here, in which case I'll go to contain. We'll find out. Oh, uh, Robertson's got that. It's good stuff. Jakubovic, what's he going to do? Launch it forward. Goalkeeping. Henriksen. Come on. No. He's going to get in the way, isn't he? He's going to go... I, I, I really want to. Lukaku's through again. And Jakubovic, I mean... You, I don't know if you actually get to see that much of Jakubovic and why I rave about him. He's gets 6.8. Have you seen how many saves he's made today? He's bloody excellent. I think Burnley might have just got us Europa League football. And that's never a sentence I thought. It's a 6-2 between West Ham and Swansea, just to mention that. But I think Burnley might have got us... It was two minutes left, just under. One and a half minutes left. We might actually sneak this. I think we've snuck this. Just Sunderland, if you do anything right now, you'll go down in my estimations even more, and I didn't think you could. That's saying something. Um, by the way, we didn't finish anywhere near the top six, but seventh. Seventh. Oh my god, I thought... Oh! I know that didn't sound enthusiastic, but it was just because that came out of nowhere. Didn't expect us to nearly score. It's... Oh. Ugh. I mean, losing on the final day of the season, it's not good, is it? This wasn't meant to be a bonanza. Did you not hear the sound effects? Put some more sound effects! I don't know. Any, any, anyway, it doesn't really matter, as long as they blow the bloody whistle on all these games. Because it looks like we might have just snuck 7th place. And that is something that you can write home about even if you're still at your house, write home to write home to say this guy on YouTube has got like 32 subscribers, but he got a hole to seventh place, and that, my friends, is the season. Um, I'll say unlucky, just because we need some confidence going into the end of the season. Because eh, to an extent, we were 15 goals. Told you, Leo Griffiths. Um, so yeah, that's where that leads us. Seventh place. Oh, who would have known? So we got 26 million for finishing seventh. Um, looking at the finances, we've actually made a shit ton of money this season. Considering you start from just a bit under zero. 65.6 million pounds in the overall balance. 
we've done wonders for the club. And there is talk of another takeover. Maybe this time we might actually get one through. Um, I'm not going to end the episode just yet. I'm going to see if I can forward a bit and get the initial budgets. So you can see what you can expect in the transfer window. Well, ladies and gentlemen, mainly gentlemen, this is the highest position we've ever finished in at Hull City. And I say we because it was all my fault. My fault? My doing. Jesus, I'm good at words. Seventh. Seventh. Their best was 16th. Seventh. We're so good at football. End of season awards. Curtis Davis nips it from Alfred and Die. The Recycler, as he's known to us. I haven't changed his name to that. Should I change his name to that? If you'd like to see his name change to the Recycler and see him back in the squad next to you, put a comment down below and tell me how much you like and die. Because I love him and I would love him to stay. It depends how much we get and how much he wanted. Signing the season, Leigh Griffiths. Young player of the season, Andrew Robertson. And the goal of the season was Will Keane versus Sunderland. Should we have a watch? So here it is, Evandra de Griffiths. Griffiths hits it to Will Keen, and he absolutely launches it into the back of the net. Fantastic goal. Lovely stuff, Will Keen. I will justifiably look back on the season with a smile on their collective faces as they defy pre-season expectations of relegation instead of mounting any campaign in which they secured continental qualification for the next season. Oh, yeah, we got knocked out of the cuts by Leeds and Sunderland, but oh, yeah, confidence... Absolutely loved it. Yeah. Demande's departure could be a bit of bad judgment. What was he done while he's in Turkey? Actually, not too bad. Shh, shh, shh. One thing I did forget to mention was our youth intake, which just completely slipped my mind. But yeah, we got two decent uh, players from it. Uh, Martin Biggs is apparently supposed to be the next big thing. Well, hey, he's not that great, actually. I look at him again. He's, he's actually just... Probably won't make it, but, you know, League One, that's where it's at for him. And then the big Don himself, it's Tony Radford. Now, this guy, he could be something special. I'm looking at him. He arrives late in opponent's area. Fashionably late. That's what I like about Tony. Well, well, well. Well... Well, 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 well then, do you know what this means? I think it's time for some more sound effects. Put sound effects on me doing this. I'm dancing. We're going to Europe on a whole adventure. I think that'll be enough for this season. Thank you for joining me on this first season. It's been one hell of a journey. And it can only go up or horrendously down. Um, hopefully with 42 million, I can't screw it up that much. But only time will tell. Thank you for watching. Like, favourite, subscribe. If you enjoy this, keep an eye out for the next episode where it'll be transfers. And maybe the start of the next season. Transfers! Thank you for watching. Goodbye for this season.